Hey family, it's your girl Trish. Welcome back to my channel for another video. If you guys are new here, we do all things beauty and lifestyle here on this channel. So if you, if you like those type of things, please feel free to subscribe and join our family over here. And if you guys are not new here, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, as you guys know, I have been hauling and hauling and hauling all of these hygiene products and buying all these hygiene products, you know, whatever. And you know, for the last, um, since I've been like, you know, hauling all these products, I have been using my products. My products is not just for, you know, looks for whatever, or whatever I buy these things to use. And so I wanted to bring you guys a favorite video, things I've been loving, um, hygiene products I've been loving um, at the moment, the things I've been reaching um, towards to a lot. So yes, that's what this video is gonna be about. So before we get into this video, I want to talk about Dossier. Dossier was nice enough to send me two perfumes. And so this uh, this is a video in collaboration with them or whatever. I just decided I'll just um, um, put the Dossier perfumes in here to review them. And I've really been liking them too. So I wanted to wanted to show you um, share um, you guys my thoughts. So I did get two perfumes. This is what the box looks like. It comes in these really cute like matte um, boxes that does have Dossier listed at the bottom. The two that I picked up is Florental Brown Sugar. Um, so I, I picked up Florental Brown Sugar and Gourmet White Gour, Gourmet White Flowers. So <clears throat> the Florental Brown Sugar is um, is is inspired by the YSL Mon Paris M Mon Paris um, perfume. Um, so this is what the bottle looks like. This one smells really really good. Um, this one has the top notes of bergamot. Bergamot, raspberry pear, middle notes of jasmine, orange blossom, and brown sugar, and then base notes of patchouli, amber, and vanilla. This, when I tell you guys, this perfume smells really, really good. Um, I can really pick up the base notes in this in this perfume. It smells really good, but I can also smell all of the floral and um, fruity notes that's in this um, perfume. Like I said, it smells really, really good. It's long lasting. Um, I wore this one night to work and I got compliments all night on this perfume. This perfume smells so good and the longevity of this perfume is beautiful. Like the, the Dossier um, perfumes are so, so, so good. Especially if you're on a budget and you don't want to spend 70, almost 100 and something dollars on an actual perfume. You can just pick these up or if you want to test out a perfume before picking up um you know these um name brand perfumes dossier is a good way to go and they're affordable and they always have in deals where you can get up uh, two for a certain amount three for a certain amount or four for a certain amount and they have calls for free shipping and all that good stuff or whatever so yes this um this is pretty much what dossier is it's a um it's a perfume company that has all these inspired scents. Oh, um, scents that it's like these scents that replica of name brand of fragrances that you can get at the fraction of a cost. And who doesn't like to save money? Who doesn't like to save money? You know, I do. I love deals. I love sales. Especially if I can get like perfume on a budget, you can't go wrong with that. And I'm a perfume lover, so this um, Dossier is the way to go, y'all. It's the way to go. But yes, I really, really love this one right here this is the brown sugar one smells so good y'all smells so super good and the concentration on this one it says is 18 percent and the next one i said i do have here is gome white flowers this one is inspired by the victor and roll flower bomb um perfume I've been wanting to get this perfume for the longest, but I say, you know what? Let me go ahead and pick up some of the um um pick the um the scents that I really been wanting. And this one smells really really good, y'all. This is a a beautiful floral scent of fragrance. Um, this one has top notes of bergamot, green tea, freesia, and berries. Middle notes of white flowers, orchid, and rose. Base notes of musk, patchouli, caramel, and vanilla. Like I said, this one is a beautiful. This one is a beautiful scent, floral scent, y'all. Um, I wore this one day out when I was running errands and I got plenty of compliments on this perfume. Like, y'all, if y'all wanna be smelling good 
you know, smelling good and saving money with, with an actual brand that's like, um, brand that has long lasting scent. Dossier, y'all, Dossier will have you all the way together just at, at a fraction of a uh, cost, as I mentioned before. This one smells so good. Like I said, it's a beautiful floral scent. It just smells so good. It smells so good, and I love the smell of musk. I love the smell of musk. I can hear, I can smell the tad bit of musk that it has in this one. It smells so good. Let me go ahead and go ahead and spray some on me, y'all. Smells super good, and like I said, the scent is long lasting. You cannot go wrong with Dossier. You cannot go wrong with them. And the good thing about Dossier is that if you do not like a certain scent or whatever, if you're unhappy with it or whatever, you can return it. You can return it, but we don't really have to worry about that because like I said, Dossier is going to have you all together and, and I'm pretty, they have a scent for everybody. They have a selection of different, a selection of different scents for you guys. So many different scents to choose from, whether if you're a man or a woman or if you would like something that's unisex, they got something for you. They got something for everybody. You can't go wrong with it. Alright y'all, so we're just going to hop right into the video. Um, I don't want this video to be so too, too, super long because I do have a few products here to share with you guys. Sorry about my voice. Um, I'm a little sore, coarse right now, whatever you want to call it, but I'm okay. I wanted to get these videos out for you guys. So, the first thing we're going to get into, I guess, is my toothpaste. I picked up this um, toothpaste on a whim when I was um, buying a few things, um, hygiene, but of course, oral hygiene is really important too. So, I got this Hello Anti Plaque um, Whitening Fluoride Free Toothpaste, and it has the um, flavor of natural peppermint with tea tree and coconut oil. This is what the bottle looks like. I really really like this I love how minty leaves my uh, mouth how fresh and clean um, certain toothpaste not a lot but just certain toothpaste tends to burn my mouth this one doesn't and it, like I said it just it just my mouth feels really fresh and clean and minty afterwards and I love like I love the feeling I get after I use this toothpaste and my teeth um it says it claims that it's a whitening and that it um, has anti-plaque and my I, I've noticed um the bright I've noticed a, a slight difference in my teeth after I, start, I started using this and I've been using this for a good month now my teeth have gotten a little bit lighter um since I've been using this toothpaste the next thing I'm gonna get into are bar soaps so I have three to show you guys um the first one here is the Dove Sensitive Skin. Of course, I have all of these in my shower already. I just didn't want to show you guys bar, the bar without showing you guys the packaging. So I got the Sensitive, the Dove Sensitive Skin Fragrance Free Bar Soap. And I've been using this in my downstairs area. Um, I really, really love how clean, um, how cleansing this is. It doesn't have any fragrance in it, so it's not going to irritate me. And I really like that about it. And I just love how, like, um how clean I feel afterwards. I don't have to worry about it disturbing my pH balance or throwing me off or whatever. So yes, I really, really love this and this is definitely gonna stay in my hygiene regimen. The next one I have here is the Olay um, Shea Butter Dove, um, not Dove, the Olay Shea Butter um, Bar Soap. And the box looks like this. It's just a regular Shea Butter Soap. I really love it. I really love how moisturizing it is on the skin. I do get a nice clean, but it's not stripping. It's not stripping at all. It's very, very moisturizing, and I can definitely smell the shea butter in the soap. It smells really, really good, and it's like I said, the lather is awesome. The next bar soap I have here is the Method Body Simply Nourish Bar Soap. This one has notes of coconut, rice milk, and shea butter in it. This is what the packaging looks like. I love this bar soap, and it's a nice size too. It's a nice size so it's like you can use this you get a couple a good amount of uses out of this bar soap and it smells really really good i've been using this to pair with my coconut scented body washers or even like um shea butter or whatever it either sh i've been using this I've been using this with a lot of my coconut scented body washes and you can even pair this with shea butter because it does have shea butter in it so yes i really love this bar soap it smells really really nice it's really moisturizing the lather is awesome and it's not stripping on the skin it, get, it gives you a good clean it still gives you it still cleans you really well but it's moisturizing at the same time and i love that i look for it like that's the type of things i look for within a bar soap and the next thing that i'll get into is i guess i'll go with the scrubs next since i'm going in order so the first thing i'm gonna start off with is the nectar bath um bath treats scrubs 
this is what the bar the um bottle looked like so i follow latoya marcinko i don't know if you guys know who that is but she's really um popular here in the hygiene community on youtube um she talks about um nectar batteries a lot and i figure i'll give them a try they had a deal where you um you get two for a certain amount so i picked up four so but this is the one i've been using a lot um i try to i don't know i i pick up pick up things as i go when i'm getting in the shower it just depends on what i'm going for and i've been using this one a lot with just like my fresh my fresh um uh, shower routine or my everyday shower routine this is really really nice i have used this quite a bit already and it, it comes in a, it comes in a it comes a lot in the jar and this is a um this is an eight ounce so you can get a good amount of uses out of it just depending on how much product you use when you exfoliate but i love this one this one is the ocean breeze one and this smells really really good it smells oh y'all got scrub on this it smells really really good um it just has a light a light it's kind of like a water scent yes it has a nice fresh water scent it's the, the scent is really light light but you can still smell it um body scrub is really nice and like i said i do have other ones that i haven't touched yet this is the one i've been using the next scrub i have here is the dove exfoliating body polish and this one the particular scent that i have here is the crush macadamia and rice milk this one is my favorite one y'all i have to pick up another one because this one is almost gone i've been using this one a lot i probably have one more use out of this one maybe two maybe two um i love the way this one smells it just has this sweet it has this sweet gourmet smell um it smells really really nice i've been using this one a lot with my shea butter scented things it smells really nice um i love the fact that it's not um a harsh exfoliant but you can still get a good polish out of it so say if you use your tree head scrub the next day if you want to scrub or the following day after that one instead of using that harsh one you can use a polish and these polishes are really really nice too like they smell really really good and they although it's just a polish you still get like a nice exfoliant out of it although it's not harsh if that makes sense it smells really really good i love it i do have all the other ones um but i haven't really touched the other ones yet this is the only one i've used so far and then the next scrub i have here is the tree hut coco colada shea sugar scrub from tree hut this is what it looks like i know a lot of everybody talk about tree hut here on youtube in the hygiene community i've really really been really enjoying this one i probably have two more uses out of this one um it's just white um you get a good amount of product in these tree hut scrubs and and they're super exfoliating all right y'all we're gonna hop into these body washes really quick the first one i have here is the dove deep moisture um body wash and this is just what the bottle looks like it just has a nice clean scent to it it's not too um heavily scented but it still smells good at the same time if that makes sense um i do have the smaller bottle this is the 12 ounce the 12 fluid ounce i've really been liking this this bottle is like halfway gone now um i've really been liking it just for when i just want to do like something quick if i don't feel like doing too much or whatever or if i get home from work and i'm too tired to really pick out a scent or whatever i just reach for this one and it's really really moisturizing the dove as you guys know the dove uh, body washes um lathers really well and they're really really moisturizing at least for me it's really really moisturizing on my skin so i've really been enjoying this um the next body wash i have here is the ogx um hydrating shake soft and smooth body body wash this is the bottle i love this body wash y'all i can't talk i can't tell you guys enough about this body wash this body wash is very moisturizing it smells so good it has a gourmet a gourmet smell um it's, it's it smells like a treat literally smells like a sweet treat it smells really really good i do have a backup bottle of this i had three but i gave one to my mama so i have one more left that i haven't touched yet this one is almost gone i probably have like three or four more uses out of this bottle um i use i do tend to use a lot of body wash whenever i do shower um like i said this one smells really really good i do own a lot of the probably all of the most of the ojx body washes this is the one i um i've been using the most um as of 
as of now i haven't really experienced i haven't really touched my other ones yet but this is the one i've been using a lot this one smells really really good when i'm going i tend to want to smell warm a lot of times like a warm gourmet smells vanilla vanilla i love things like that so i tend to reach for this one a lot when i'm going for like something like that or just shea butter in general so i really really love this one um it smells really really good like i said i can't tell you guys enough about this one it smells really really good um the next one i have here is the philosophy fresh cream and mint body wash i have used this one a couple of times already um it's really really moisturizing it feels so good on the skin this one just has a clean mint scent um i can smell a little bit of fresh uh cream in it um this one does says it has vanilla in it um yes vanilla sugar and peppermint but i get more of that minty um feel a um, minty smell out of it but like i said I, I can smell the cream a little bit so this is it smells super super good super clean like i said it's really really moisturizing on the skin it smells it feels really good and the lather is amazing i really really love the way this one lathers up and then the next body wash i have here is the saint eye soothing body wash in oatmeal and shea butter y'all i've really been loving this body wash i really need to get another one but i'll get another another one when i'm almost running out i'm almost halfway done with this bottle i don't know if you guys can tell i've used this one a lot um, when I want to do like a shea butter scented routine, I do have a lot of shea butter scented body washes, but this is the one that I've been using a lot because I haven't really touched my other ones yet. But I really, really like this one. It's really moisturizing and the lather is really, really good. This one has a sweet smell. It, you can smell the shea butter and the oatmeal, but it, it has more of a sweet scent of if anything. It smells really, really good. It smells really, really good, y'all. It smells really, really good. I'm going to get another one whenever it's almost gone this is definitely going to stay in my um stay in my um stash of body washes um and the next body wash i do have is the johnson skin nourish shake and cocoa butter wash i've really been liking this body wash whenever i want something quick i just use this body wash and i keep it pushing it is the lather is really really nice and it's really really moisturizing and who doesn't want to feel and smell like a baby who doesn't you know so yes i really really love this body wash and to pair with that i've really been using i've really been loving the johnson's creamy oil shea and cocoa butter i i typically use it to get i usually use both of them together um you don't have to use both of them together you can use them separately if you want to but i've been using them together i really love how thick and creamy this is it turns into a, a, a oil but it's actually really creamy as well i really really like the way it feels and it's somewhat um it's creamy but it's still lightweight if that makes sense it's not it's not thin and it's not thick it just has that perfect balance and i like that because now that we're in the warmer months i don't you know i don't want to feel like super like um i don't want nothing too 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 heavy on my skin if that makes sense i do love thicker lotions and creams but you know i do like i don't like to feel especially if i'm going out or not going out if i'm going to sleep i don't want to i don't want nothing heavy on my skin because i don't like being hot when i'm asleep if that makes sense so really been liking this um the next lotion i've really been liking or cream i really been loving is the dove um rich nourishment cream and it looks just like this a lot although it comes in this little jar a lot actually comes in this um what how many ounces is this this is five ounces it does have quite a bit of product in it it's really nice on the skin it feels really good it's really creamy it doesn't take a long time to rub this in and a little goes a long way i really really love this cream i had to get two more just so i don't run out i always want to have this in my collection it's, it just feels so good so this is the one right here this is the one i have picked up um this body butter from marshall's it was either i picked this up from tj maxx and but you can find them in marshall's too and the first time i used this i went crazy i went to ulta and i was literally on a hunt i went to walk from ulta and i picked up some when they went on sale and i also had picked up some other ones from marshall's and tj maxx when i um what when i um when i would whenever i would see like other um scents they are so thick and creamy y'all they think they're creamy they don't take it doesn't take much to rub in 
a little goes a long way they're super super moisturizing when i tell y'all this is I feel like every girl, if you love body butter, if you love body butters and creams, you will love the body shop stuff because they're really good. They're really, really good. Um, I won't say everybody will like this, but if, like I said, if you into like thick body creams and body butters, you will love the body shop. They smell really, really good. The fragrance loads, and I have used this already. The fragrance load on these is really nice. Um, if, if you're the type of person that like that that like actually like to smell the fragrance within your creams and your lotions or whatever not your lotions but your creams and your body butters the body shop is the way to go because they smell so good and they're really moisturizing you guys they're super moisturizing i love these body butters i didn't think i would ever like a body butter more than the tree hut uh, body butters not the new formula the old formula i used to love the tree hut body butters when i was in college but i used to get the one the the old version of the body butters but we're not gonna get into that but yes yeah, so yes this is right here the, the the body shop formulas are really really good i have i have mostly all of the scents now um yes you can't go wrong with these body butters they're they're really nice they're really really nice um the next lotion i have here is the um uh soap and glory smoothie star almond and vanilla body milk it's a lotion um this one is smells so good um <clears throat> it just smells so good y'all this is just the creamy notes of almond and vanilla it's like it just goes so well together and it smells so like creamy and gourmet i just love the way they i love the way it smells and it goes on the um skin like a dream it's not thin but it's not thick either it has that perfect medium and and it just it just rubs into your skin so well it doesn't take much to rub this one in it's super super good y'all so if you guys have not tried this one yet i definitely suggest picking this one up the next cream I have here is the Jurgens. Y'all, I love lotions and body butters. I really had to like, you know, narrow it down and pick the ones I've really been using a lot. The next one I have here is the Jurgens Body Butter Collection. Um, and this is the one in Eucalyptus Mint. I do have two other ones, but <coughs> this is the one I've been using a lot. Um, I love how minty this one sm uh, uh, smells. I tend to pick this one up a lot whenever I'm doing like a fresh uh, scented um, body routine, shower routine. It smells really, really good. And I love how moisturizing and thick this one is. Super, super good to the skin. And it rubs into the skin really nice. Um, the last lotion I have here is the EOS. Everybody talks about this lotion, y'all. Everybody talks about this one. Um, it's the EOS Shea Butter 24 Hour Moisture Body Lotion in Vanilla Cashmere. Y'all, I love this body lotion. I'm halfway done with this bottle. I do have a backup that I haven't opened up yet, but I do have this in two other scents. I wish they had the, I can't ever find Jasmine Peach anywhere. I've been wanting to get that one, but I can't find that one anywhere. But I've really been loving this one. Um, I love the way this one smells. It smells really, really sweet. Usually whenever I use this body wash or any shea butter one i put this together or any vanilla scented um shower gel so these two right here together is a dream usually when i pair these two together i smell like a treat all night and i and i do this at night too when i do this and when i wear this or sometimes during the day but you just smell like a warm treat you smell like a treat like it's just it's so good i love the way i love the way these two smell together and they do smell um they do both of them do smell really good but when you pair them together you just smell like a you just smell like a sweet treat all day all night super super comfortable even even my fiance be calm he love he be complimenting me on that smell on that scent whenever i wear these two products because they just complement each other so 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 well and then the last little few things i have here so i do have a johnson's baby oil that i've really been liking here this is um this bottle I haven't opened, but I do have another bottle, the bottle that I've been using in my bathroom. That one is like halfway gone already. Um, I do um, have the two smaller bottles that I picked up for Walgreens. Um, I bought these ones first. Um, I will get the bigger bottle once I finish up these two. Um, a little goes a long way. Um, they smell really, really good. You smell like a fresh, fresh baby as soon as you get out the shower when you put this on. It's super, super moisturizing. Um, it doesn't take a lot to... Um, 
moisturize yourself with this and i really really love the um johnson's baby oil y'all i do have have it in another scent um two other scents actually but i tend to pick up this one a lot whenever i'm going for a fresh scented um body uh, a fresh scented shower routine or and, and even sometimes i like to pair this with all of my other shower routines when i'm going for something specifically um scented or whatever because you can pair this with anything honestly and it makes your skin super super soft super super soft and then the next thing is three things i have here are just um body um body mist um fragrance mist or whatever i don't know if you guys know this but i didn't include no victoria's secrets and bath and body Works products in this video because i will do a separate video on the sense that i've been reaching for them for a lot reaching towards a lot and the ones i'm really loving at the moment so that's why i didn't put any bath and body works and um victoria's secret stuff in this video so the first two things first two bits i have here is the body fantasies uh sprays i do have a whole little a little collection of their um sprays but these two are the ones that i've been wearing a lot the white um the first one i have here is fresh white musk I love musky scents. I love when it's um, paired with floral notes. I really, really love this one. I um, tend to use these ones when I um, when I'm going to sleep at night. Um, they do linger for hours, so sometimes when I wake up at in the morning, I can still smell these fragrances on me. So if you're like on a budget, or if you're in high school or middle school, or whatever, and you don't have a lot of money to spend on like um, higher and um, fragrance mists, uh, Body Fantasies have their um, their fragrance mist is very strong and they're very lingering they're, and they're even light enough so what, about to, what am I trying to say they, you can layer them so if you want it to be like a light scent just do like one or two sprays or if you want to go really heavy with it you can do a couple of scents but it doesn't take a lot for this to be lingering these um these uh, fragrance mist but this is the one I've been wearing a lot um, I've been wearing this one a lot when I'm going to sleep um partic particularly whenever I do like my fresh scented uh, shower routine I pick this one up a lot um when i if i'm not pairing something with my bath and body work stuff or my victoria's secret stuff this is the one i'll pick up this is really really nice um yes i really really love this set and then the next one i have here is the vanilla one it smells just like um vanilla lace i don't know if you guys remember vanilla lace from victoria's secrets i don't know why they discontinued that um that scent but we're not gonna get into that this one this um scent really it, it reminds me a lot of this um re reminds me a lot of that scent and um yes it smells really really good and this is a, a a nice dupe for bare vanilla as well um smells really really good i wear this too a lot whenever i'm doing any vanilla a shea butter or oatmeal or whatever <laughs> i use this one a lot as well really really nice and then the last spray i have here is the body Ecology whip vanilla this one smells really really good um you can pair this with any shea butter vanilla scented shower routine this is that's why i tend to use this one a lot and the scent on the body ecology um sprays are really lingering as well so a lot of times when i wake up and i can still smell it um i do really really like the scent and sometimes too when i don't feel like doing too much when i'm getting ready for work i'll just either pick up my body fantasy stuff or my um body ecology stuff and i keep it pushing i don't sometimes i don't sometimes i don't really care too much i'm not saying care too much but sometimes i just want to do something quick and go you know so yeah <clears throat> and the last thing i want to talk about here is my facial steamer y'all the longest time i was using a pot and some water over the stove to steam my face on my pair for days but i finally got me a facial steamer and i got this from uh lux skin um this is what the steamer looked like really really nice um i picked this up like i said i got this from lux skin and i bought this back in april and ever since ever since i picked up this Ever since I picked up this steamer, I've really, really been loving it. Um, I, I, I use it once a week as I do my pamper routines, routines once a week just to, you know, reset and just to tend to myself because every woman needs to tend to themselves and really go in on themselves at least once a week because we work hard. We pretty much, the, um, we're, um, we take care of the home. We work hard. Just stuff like that. So, you got to take care. You have to take out time for yourself at least once a week, y'all. So, 
I really love steam in my face, so I figured I'll get this from Lux Kit, and I've really been loving it. It this it produces a, a nice steam, and you can just it don't need no batteries, y'all. You plug it in, no batteries, no no batteries. And that is it for this um, video, you guys. If you guys want me to do continue to do more um, videos like this, in particular, um, my favorites, just let me know down in the comment section. I'll do these like every two months or so, or every month, but I'll probably do them every other month. So yeah, um, like I said, if you guys really enjoyed this video, please um, leave me something nice in the comment section. Thumbs up this video, and if you guys want to see more hygiene related content from me and any other lifestyle or beauty related content from me, be sure to become a part of our family, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Mwah.